Let's go to the handout for the quadric surfaces. Uh, this lesson is to look at the equations and how it relate to uh, the, the graphs. So first, you have the, the most basic equation. This one, this is the equation for a sphere. So this, and so this one has all the same coefficients of one. And therefore, it's, so the radius in x direction, y direction, and z direction are the same. Therefore, it's a sphere. Now, these two are very similar. This one, the coefficients are different. So this is ellipsoid, just like uh, the two-dimensional, you have the, the ellipse, right? But three-dimensional is ellipsoid. So this looks like an egg or like a football, okay? whereas this is like a ball. And the reason for that is because you have different coefficients, so you have different radius in, in different directions. And so you, you have a shape that looks like an egg. Okay. Now, next thing is that from here, if you notice that, that the following three, right, each one of these have a minus. So they are the same group. So when you have a, one of the term is, if one of the term is minus, so you're going to get one sheet. So you can have one minus. And the one that's different from uh, the other two would be the, op the direction of the opening. So notice this one, the z is different from the other two. So this would be, so opening would open to the z direction. So this would be in the z direction. So z would be, this would be the z. Okay? Again, this is the opening. And if you have the negative on the y, then the opening would be in the y direction. So again, this is the opening of the graph. So right now, this graph is for the, for the y, y direction. Okay? So this is graph is for this. And this one over here, if the x is negative, and it will open, the opening would be open toward the x direction. Okay, so again, the one that's different from the other, that would be the direction of the opening. And if there's one minus, then there would be one sheet. Okay, so one sheet means one piece. This, this whole thing is one, one, one surface. Okay. And this one over here, this is a hy uh, hyperboloid of two sheets. So notice there are two minuses now. Okay. So when there are two minuses, then there would be two sheets. And again, the, the x is different from the other two, so this, this would be opening to the x direction. So the variable that is different from the other two would be the directions of the opening. Okay? So like this one right now, this is opening in the y direction, so this would be for this one here. Okay? So you can notice, again, there are two minuses, therefore this is two sheets. When there's a one minus, it's one sheet. And the one that's different from the other two would be the direction of opening. So like this one over here, this is a minus, this is a minus, this is a plus. So this is a different from the other two. So this would be, if you have this equation, this will open in the z direction. Okay. And from here to here, notice that one of them has no square. So again, the one that's different is the direction of opening. So z is different from the other two. So this is opening in the z direction. Okay. And this, this one, the y is different from the other two, so this is open in the y direction. So again, this picture is for this. Now, these two are very similar. The difference is that this is a square. So like this is a, this is a square. So when you, when you move things around, when you take the square root, so you're going to get plus or minus. Okay? So again, because of a square, when you take the square root, you're going to get plus or minus. Whereas this one doesn't have a square, so, so you're going to either get positive or negative. Okay. So again, this is like the square root of that. So therefore, you're going, you only have one of that instead of two. Okay. Now, if you compare this one with the... So this one has one, one subtraction. So it, it looks like one sheet, right? So this is going to be one sheet. But the difference between... The, the, the comparison between that and the, and the one sheet is that, that this is equal to zero. And this is equal to one. So when, you, when this is equal to 1, there is something in the middle, okay? When it's equal to 0, it gets squeezed. So there's, there's a dot. And notice it gets smoothed out. Okay? So you can make a comparison between, between this and this. Okay? So you can edit the cone, uh, cone uh, because it's equal to 0, so there's a dot over here, and, and it gets straightened out. Okay? Whereas for the one sheet, it's equal to 1. So you got some number, so you got some, something in, in the... In the in the, uh, the middle right of the, the center over here. So these are certain characteristics of, of, of the equations and, and the surfaces. Okay, so again, to sum up, okay, this one don't have minuses, so therefore there's no opening. 
Therefore, it's, it's everything, every direction is closed. Therefore, it's, an, it's like an egg. This over here, okay, that's one minus. So therefore, it's one sheet. And this is different from the other, so this would be in the Z direction. This is different from the other, so this would be in X direction. This is different from the other two, so this would be in X direction. Again, there's only one minus, so it's one sheet. Over here, there are two minuses, so this is two sheets. Okay? And the X is different from the other two, so this is X direction. This one, the Y is different from the other two, so this is Y direction. This is Z is different from the other two, so this is Z direction. So you can, two minuses, two sheets. Okay, two sheets means two pieces, right? And this one, uh, again, you, this one, this would be, um, the Z is different from the other two, so Z, so this would be in Z direction. This is different from the other two, so this is Y direction. X is different from the other two, so this would be X direction. And this, this is very similar to, uh, to this one over here. Again, this, because this has only one, this only can be either positive or negative, therefore only one part. Whereas over here, you can have the plus or minus because the square, when you take the square root, you get plus or minus. Okay. And this one over here, this is very similar to the one sheet because that's, because that's one minus, right? So one minus is one sheet, right? But because it's going to be zero, that means in the middle of it, it has only one dot. There's no, there's no radius over here. Okay, so the, unlike over here, you're gonna get something because it's equal to, this is equal to one, so you got something over here, okay? Over here, you got zero, so all you're gonna have is a dot right over here and, and the things get smoothed out. So again, this is kind of similar, okay? So this is almost like a special case of that. So these are some of the characteristics of, of, the, of the quadric uh, surface related to its equations.